I was at the top and I fell off. Get me up, I fell off. Good. Okay. baby was once at the top of the rap industry, dropping two number one albums back to back, but the music video he uploaded to YouTube last week doesn't even have 100,000 views. You might think you know why he fell off, but from leaked NSFW videos to facing crazy jail time, his story actually goes way deeper. See, what makes his story so interesting is unlike most rappers who fell off, baby actually has some talent, proving it on freestyles like these. Off the top, don't believe the hype, is, baby, I'm pushing P. Double off in my side, drop the window with the light just to let the look at me. Yeah, I won't keep it, I'd rather be free with her. Give it back to the streets, keep it G with her. Might me for three years, only three times will I sit down in public and eat. He started making music back in 2014, but it wasn't until 2019 when he would put out his big hit single called Shug that would reach number 10 on the Billboard's Hot 100 for its catchy hook, but mainly because of it becoming a massive TikTok trend. Another one. Huh? Packing the mail, it's gone. Uh, she like I smell cologne. Unlike most new up and coming rappers, the baby wasn't pulling crazy stunts for clout, although he was talking about women, drugs, and even became a meme, which made him even more famous. Let's go. At this point in time, the baby was actually pretty likable, posting funny moments that happened in his day to day life on Instagram and TikTok, making him seem genuine to his fan base. But then it started to come crashing down when he uploaded this video to Twitter, randomly going after kids YouTuber Jojo Siwa. Let's go, Siwa. You See, this is one of the first of many incidents that would lead to his actual downfall. In this specific case, it was just overall random as he had already established himself as a sort of gangster rapper, so going after a literal child mainly just confused the internet. Baby then went on a podcast and claimed that he didn't care about being cancelled until it went after his money, which sort of predicted the future. Opinion around you. I don't value it until it get to messing with my money. After saying this, he would go on to make extremely homophobic comments at a live show, which would get him blacklisted from performing live that year. Fellas, if you ain't sucking in the parking lot, put your cell phone on, I see From this, he had lost out on tens of millions of dollars in touring money. And now fans were trying to hate on DaBaby. Plus, it didn't help that this video dropped a couple months later of him trying to kiss a fan. <laughs> See, some of these incidents did lose him crazy amounts of money and pretty much just destroyed his reputation, but this last thing sealed the deal. You might know that a couple years back, DaBaby was in a whole situation that ended up with him fatally shooting a man in a Walmart. Because of this, he was put on probation for a year and not allowed to carry a firearm, already inching towards the wrong side of the law. But then, just last year on the shoot of a music video, DaBaby got into an argument with the owner of the house and ended up physically assaulting the man, punching him in the face, and he's being sued for it. Baby's currently being charged with a felony battery charge, and things aren't really looking too good for him. His album Baby on Baby 2 sold 87% less compared to his other albums, and I think this could be attributed to his horrible public image mixed with a decline in music quality. Hilariously though, three months ago in a music video for his song Boogeyman, there was a skit involving Baby apologizing to a gay person for the Rolling Loud incident, showing that he probably doesn't care all that much. Hey look, I'm glad you made it out of it though. You know I'm saying? I'm gonna go finish this new album. Hey, my bad about that Rolling Loud shit too. I ain't mean that. And finally, just a few weeks ago, he posted this video to his socials, which shows us just how badly falling off has really affected his life. Hey yo, what happened to your leg? I was at the top and I fell off. But I think that the baby would hit the subscribe button, and you should too.